So we have a keychain that we have made, and you're making sure that you're following all the design requirements to your keychain. Um, can't be more than three inches square. We can't be more than three inches one way, three inches on the x-axis, three inches on the y-axis. And it can't be, how, how thick can it be? What's the thickest it could be? Three sixteenths. So somewhere between one eighth of an inch and three sixteenths of an inch. So there's a thickness uh, component to it. So to create an STL file, you'll go file. Obviously, you, you've already saved it, OK? So you've saved it somewhere. Then you're going to go, once it's saved, you're going to go export CAD format right here, OK? And you're going to pull this list down. And you're going to go all the way to the bottom. It says STL. And if you can't see that, that's OK. Uh, but you'll be able to watch the video as well. STL is the file format. Then you're going to name it something. Uh, you should name it uh, your name uh, slash you know, key chain. So underscore STL file. Now, here's the most important part. If you don't do this, it will not save correctly. Okay? You need to go down to options. And you need to make sure your units are, gone, are on millimeter. By default, they're going to go be on centimeter. Okay? And it sounds kind of uh, weird because you think, hey, we had to do this in inches. But in order to for the machine to read it, it has to be set to millimeter. OK. And then you will save it. Okay, And then you can turn in that file.